Welcome Virgos! Virgos, I have to pull your cards. Virgos, ah, this is the month of November. Please remember to like and share, Virgos. Like and share. All right, I got the guest there to shuffle up for you, Virgos. Uh, two first weeks is going to be good, Virgos. That is the Scorpion week. It's uh, positive emotions. The two last week are also going to be good because it is Sagittarian. That is a frequency of nine. You Virgos are on the frequency of nine. Let's see what's coming out for the Virgo Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. Ooh, Virgo. Go back and look at your October reading to see if anything affected you um, in the month of October. Remember, we look at the night houses. Night houses. All right, so what's coming up in the first house for you, Virgos? Lux and abundance. A lot of you are going to be overcoming a situation that Aries have brought you in. Um, The Hermit is shedding light on how some of you virgos got your money okay so be aware and the ten of cups happiness and joy a lot of you virgos are going to be happy where you are and uh, where you are being oh what is this so the seven oh. seven this is a detachment energy that's in your home that's in your house What's going on? The seven of wands. It's like you have no grounds to stand on, Virgos. The energy of the lovers is in the house of friendship. So, yes, a friend could become your yes, seven of wands. Oh, seven of swords. Seven of wands. Seven of wands. You're standing your ground. Uh, but that's in your own house. Someone could be moving in. You're trying to find strength to deal with a marriage or some sort of a legal situation that is going on. Major issue, you're dealing with your marriage, your lover, okay? Definitely um, your husband. The two of pentacles, you're going to be having luck. If you're looking for a part-time job, you're going to be having luck, Okay. This energy of the lovers, if you're a Virgo that is in a relationship with a Leo, you are going to be having some sort of a serious problem. Leo, Scorpion, Aquarian, Leo, Scorpion, Aquarian, you're going to be having some serious problem. The two of swords, something is now coming out. You are blindfolded about your partner, whoever your partner is, and now you're no longer blindfolded. You're seeing this person for who they are. The Prince of Disc. There is this young person this could be your son could be finding out what your partner has done okay yes uh good news is going to be coming in you're going to be overcoming an aquarian uh this is in the house of aquarius you virgos are going to be overcoming an aquarian it's like whoever this young capricorn person is is going to be telling you something about an Aquarian and what Aquarian has done, okay? And the Eight of Cups, and you're going to be emotional. You're going to be emotionally walking away from this person. You're going to be just like leaving this person behind. Like, you know, your emotion, you're going to be cutting your emotion because this was a karmatic situation. Seven of Pentacles. You're not going to be working on a relationship, a marriage anymore. You're going to be like, let it go. Yes, you're ending it. And if you were in a relationship with an Aries Leo or Sagittarian, you're going to be ending this Virgo. Okay, definitely. Definitely. Yeah, you're going to be ending this. You are also going to be finding out, Virgos, that if your partner was having an affair or seeing someone else, you're going to be finding out that it's an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian person. Deceptive. So truths is coming out because the Seven of Swords, you're going to be finding out that your partner or whoever you're in a relationship with, if this person is a Leo, an Aquarian, a Taurus, 
Leo, Aquarian, Taurus, or uh, Scorpion. Okay, energy of the lovers. For some of you, you were married to this person. For some of you, you were seeing this person. Okay, but you're going to be recognizing something about this person, whoever this person is. Okay. All right, looks and abundant. You're going to be really happy, Virgos. Uh, this, this, this happiness, Virgos, you're going to find inner happiness. It's like you let go of a marriage, a relationship, or someone, and you can breathe. You feel, you feel much more happier. You, you just feel much more happier. You're like, why didn't I do this, uh, you know, a long time ago? Some sort of a news is going to be coming in because they're going to be finding out something and it is going to affect your money, okay? Uh, happiness and joy, because uh, whatever is going on, this happiness and joy is that they're looking at uh, a family, okay? I don't know who this family is and whatever is going on, but um, whatever is going on is that uh, you Virgos are going to be overcoming a situation that a family has done to you, whether it's your family or another family. Um, the, the judge is now looking at the situation. Uh, then we see the lawyer. A lot of problems surrounding the house for you Virgos. That is in the fourth house. Some sort of a legal issue surrounding the house is going to be coming up for you Virgos. Okay, this does not look good. I can't tell you um, that it is looking good. It's not. I see your praying. Is it like you're praying for someone to come back to you? Yes. But this this is a situation where an Aquarian person, an Aquarian woman, if you're in a relationship with an Aquarian woman, you could be praying that this person don't leave or this person come back. But there is a situation with Aquarian woman. It's like you, Virgos, it could be a lawyer, but... I, it's not coming up as in a lawyer because it's the seven of swords. So it's deceptiveness. They're going to be recognizing that a woman was not being um, honest. An apology. You're trying to apologize for something Virgo, but you're having it very hard because this apology that you're trying to give is like it's not being accepted. Um, a Capricorn person is going to be regaining a whole lot of money. And the reason why, because Jupiter is in Capricorn, um, it has something to do with, uh, like, if you try to fire a person or lied on a person, you have to pay the person for damages. Okay, so if you try to fire a person or lied on a person or created some sort of a misfortune for a person, they, the judge is going to be ordered that this person be paid for damages that you have done to this person. They found out who a child belongs to. They found out who is the father for a child. They found out uh, um, the secret about a child. A government institution is going to be protected. Um, a Capricorn person or a Capricorn business um, from something that you Virgos have done. A lot of you Virgos are waiting for some sort of a news. This is a victory. But it's like you're, you're going to be victorious over coming an Aquarian. Okay, because it's like this person is putting themselves... Uh, Yes, an investigation is going to be taking place. Um, yes, uh, an investigate. This is the eight of uh, the eight of cups. You're going. You Virgos are going to be very emotional. Something concerning a Pisces, where a Pisces is connected to some sort of an investigation, um, but it is not as bad as you think it is. So let's say you're a Virgo mother and a Pisces. No, it's not bad. They're actually um, going to be protecting this person. So if you're a Virgo mother and you have a Pisces person as a child or parents or family, okay? So a lot of you Virgos wanted some sort of a new start, thinking of creating some sort of a new start for yourself. You're protecting yourself and protecting your money at all costs. You Virgos are like, I don't care who's coming, who wants to share what? I'm protecting myself and my money. Yes, a family is going to be protected. And whoever this family is, so this family is going to be protected because they're now going to be recognized. Heartbreaks is coming up. And this heartbreaks has to do 
um, with some sort of a, uh, because this is this is the seven, and it's it's, it's in a reverse, and this the situation is like um, you Virgos have no foot to stand on surround surrounding a house a, a, a house because this is the fourth house, so you Virgos have no foot to stand on. Um, they now recognize, um, you Virgos are going to be recognizing, um, that a Leo had some sort of an affair, a Leo woman had some sort of an affair with your partner. Okay. I see no movement. This person is not going to be moving forward. It could be an Aquarian person, an Aquarian young woman is not going to be moving forward. Um, something about an Aquarian young woman. I don't know if it's your child, whoever this person is, they could have wanted to move out. They could have wanted to travel. It's not going to be happening. You're going to be overcoming a problem because I see you Virgos are going, are going back to apologize to someone, but it's like this person don't want um, your apology, but it's something about movement and travel judgment call. And um, this is positive because obviously a Capricorn person is going to be regaining what was stolen from them. A huge tower moment is coming down because they recognize that a Leo woman had lied. A Leo woman and her lover or a Leo woman who was having an affair lied. Okay. J yes, I told you. I told you about this Capricorn person. So this is Aquarius. So Venus in Aquarius with a government institution is going to be protecting a Capricorn person from something that you Virgos have done. There is the Capricorn again. You have to pay a Capricorn person for damage because you try to ruin a Capricorn person repetition. And they're great. Yes. Um, they now recognize what a Leo man has done. You Virgos are waiting for some sort of a news from a Leo man, but they're recognizing hardship is going to be coming in. And if some of you Virgos was having some sort of a hardship, not to worry. I see this is emotional, but not to worry. It's going to be working out. Okay. All right. So I see help is going to be coming in for you, Virgos. Uh, that is good. I see a lot of you, Virgos, are thinking about to relocate. All right. A lot of you, Virgos, are thinking about to relocate. There is, there is, um, the houses that you need to take a look at um, and the people at Leo. I see you Virgos, like you're praying for this Leo um, to come back. Why? You don't do good with Leos, Virgos. You do good with Sagittarian, Pisces, uh, uh, Geminis, not Virgos, not Leos. Yeah, art breaks for a lawyer. Yep. Art breaks for a lawyer. A lawyer did not win a case. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, Virgos. A lawyer didn't win a case. Mm -mm. A lawyer didn't win a case. There's a lot of dis. <laughs> Sorry. A lot of dishonesty that is going on. A lawyer didn't win a case. They recognized. That a lawyer could create some sort of a disillusion. Okay, a lawyer didn't win a case. No. Heartbreaks for a Libran. Librans can be lawyers. Mm -hmm. Librans can be lawyers. Mm -hmm. da -da -da -da. Da, 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 da. Oh, that was not all oh good. But it's going to be a good month, Virgos. Um, there's no question about this month. It's really, really going to be a good month. A lot of you, Virgos, are going to be thinking about relocating. Ascendance Masters. Virgos, I knew this was going to be coming up for you guys. and Because you, Virgos, in the two first weeks is... Uh, emotional it is positive it's a week of a scorpion two last week is week of sagittarian but you virgos need to connect to the unseen 
Okay, you Virgos are guarded by the unseen. The Ascendance Masters is going to be coming in in the first week. And they're going to be telling you something about this Leo person. Believe what they say. Visualize success in the second week because some good news is going to be coming in. Okay. Uh, so the Sacral Chakra, you need to take back your power from other people. Don't let people walk over you. That is what it means. Okay. And the God Box. I always tell you guys about the God box. You need to use the God box. Call up also on your power, um, your power animals. Um, so call up on your power animals, okay? Use the God box. The God box is a little box that you do nothing else in, but write your gifts, your wishes and dreams in the present tense that thank you for whatever it is. Thank you for this new car. Thank you for this new house. Thank you for this new apartment, Whatever it is, thank you. You have received it. Use your God box, okay? All right, so these are positive. Virgos, I never expect anything different. Um, this is just so powerful. No new start for a Leo person. A towel moment for a Leo person and their child. I don't know who this Leo, and it's like you Virgos are going to be fun. Oopsie daisy. Okay. All right, um, something for a man, no stability for a man. I don't know if it's um, your partner, your ex-partner, or this man is you, Virgos. No, uh, no long-term stability for this man. It's going to be um, cut. Okay, so whoever this man is, maybe someone you're starting a relationship with, maybe it's a... But no long-term stability for this man. It fell out in the reverse. They're going to be like cutting, uh, changing something. A man is going to be losing his long-term stability. So Virgos, if you did something and they recognize that you were behind doing a situation, you're going to be caught. They're going to be canceling. If you had something, some sort of a contractual or long-term commitment, they're going to cancel it. I see they're going to be also canceling for a man. I don't know who this man is. If some of you um, Virgos could be just um, ending a re relationship or a marriage with a man. Okay, the Ascendance Masters. Luck. Luck. Luck is here in the first week. And um, as I told you, um, you're going to be, by connecting with your spirit guides, you're going to be getting great ideas in order to do great things, okay? Um, they recognize that someone has stolen a letter or some sort of a document or some sort of a information. They now recognize, because they recognize that some sort of a document was sent and someone stole it, okay? Um, the three, uh, somebody... Um, don't risk anything. I uh, don't play any riskful games. Don't make any risk. Not in the third week. Okay. This is serious. Okay. Don't, don't, don't make any, no, not in the third week. Okay. All right. Some sort of an invitation is going to be coming in Virgo. Um, this is why I said, write what you need in your God box. Um, and uh, some sort of an invitation is going to be coming in, but uh, this can be positive for some of you. Um, but if you have anything with legal issue surrounding a house is not a win Virgos. I can tell you, um, this from now. Okay. I got to look at a certain things because, um, whatever is happening, I see you Virgos are praying for, a Aries person, a Leo person, judge. It doesn't work. Nope. Maybe it's your mom, you know, but it's in the house of friendship, the lovers. Some of you Virgos are manipulated to think that a a Virgo woman, a, 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 um, a Leo woman is your soulmate or a partner or a no, don't pray for me, Argentina. And the truth, no, 
Nah, no, could be a mother-in-law. Um, but these are serious, serious things, okay? It's not looking good. It's really, really not looking good, Virgos, because I see what is happening, Virgos, because I'm going to be looking at this. Um, because it's like you are praying for this Leo woman. I don't know. Yeah, you want a new start for this Leo. No, it's and some sort of a, a, a no, it's not. You want a new start, or you're praying for um that a situation result in this person favor, but no, it's it's um it can be a Sagittarian person also. You're praying that this person will come back, and you know they could they could have been deciding to move on to gain some sort of a new start, whatever it is, but. It's, you know, whoever the Sagittarian person is, it's like you're praying and you're trying to hold on. If people want to leave, let people leave. You know, heartbreaks. Oh, yes. News came in. Yes. About some sort of a, um, it's like, I love you, Virgos. If you had bought a property together, news is going to be coming in that you have to leave the property. Okay, Virgos, I'm advising you. Okay. So emotional. Oh, the energy of the devil. Oh, my God. They are they're are now recognizing if you Virgos was in a relationship or some sort of a conflict with an Aries Lee or a Sagittarian man, you Virgos are now going to be recognizing what this man has done. And you're going to be seriously really recognizing how um, in, you know, how really in, you know, this person has no a sense of uh, concern about another human person um no you know p you know uh, whatever is going on whoever this man is cuz he's in the reverse and a lot of people are seeing the truth about this man this is a Aries Leo or Sagittarian man uh, that this man has no conscience and you're going to be recognizing how far this man has gone okay you're going to be really recognizing. Um, and, you know, whoever this person is and whatever this person have done, it was not nice. A lot of you Virgos are going to decide, I do not want someone back in my life. I don't want this marriage. I don't want this person. Um, I end it and, uh, you know, let it go. I'll find someone else. It's like you Virgos now recognize that everyone just see this person for who they are. However, this is coming up, but you have a very positive. There is, let's see the deceptiveness because there is a deceptiveness in your second house. Um, some sort of an offer, some sort of a communication. It has to do with an Aquarian woman. Okay. They're going to be recognizing something what an Aquarian woman has done. Uh, they're going to be catching an Aquarian woman. It could be someone in a bank, a financial institution, or someone that could have fraud or created some sort of a disillusion surrounding um, your money. They're going to be recognizing what this person have done. Virgos, it's going to be a beautiful month. Yes, um, it's going to be a beautiful month. Um, and... Uh, um, a, a legal situation is not going to be turning out good for you, Virgos. I'm sorry, but it's in that fourth house, and now we're seeing it again. Um, seeing you know, and you're going to be regretting it, but you know, let go. If you did not get someone in the, something in the right and proper way, um, let it go. Let it go. You gotta let go something so that something new can come in. I do love you guys. I gotta go. Namaste.